Hello guys, my name is David, 21 years old. I've been skating for about two and a half, almost three years now. And I wanna share with you my personal testimony how I came to know God and have a relationship with Jesus. So I grew up in the church. Uh, my parents are Christian, brothers and sisters are Christian. I have about 10, 11 siblings. So we all grew up going to church every Sunday. And I learned all the stories about the Bible and you know what Jesus did, but I didn't really understand the significance of it you know so going throughout middle school into high school you know i didn't get into any drugs or different things like that because i knew since from church that those things weren't good to get into and i didn't want to get into any of those things i see what my friends were going through and different things that they were experiencing and the different you know backlashes from like vaping and smoking and drinking and you know having sex and all these different things so i didn't want to just believe what my parents taught me and what I heard in church just because they taught me it you know I wanted to actually know the truth so about when I was 17 about to turn 18 my junior year into my senior year of high school I started doing a lot of research about you know different religions like Judaism Buddhism Hinduism Islam and Christianity as well different you know polytheistic and monotheistic religions and then out of all the different religions I was studying, I came to understand that the Bible is reliable throughout all my research and throughout all the different historical documents. And then I started to really start reading the Bible, starting to pray more. And I started to understand like more of what the Bible was saying and the stories and everything that I heard started to actually come to life. And I started to really understand them fully. And that's when I started to pray more and actually start a relationship with God. You know, I actually gave my life to Jesus my senior year and it was amazing. You know, it wasn't like I was talking to like an inanimate object, like a rock or a statue. He actually spoke back to me and started working in my life and I received the Holy Spirit. And now every day it's a, just a walk with him. And it's amazing. He delivered me from, you know, pornography, delivered me from different things that I was dealing with like depression and suicidal thoughts things like that, that I was experiencing throughout high school and stuff of that nature you know and then now I'm able to walk in life and in joy and peace and just love and be able to share that love with other people like you guys you know so it's definitely been a blessing so a verse I want to share with you guys is out of the book of Romans it's Romans 8 28 and the scripture says that we know that all things work together for the good of those who love God, for those who are called according to his purposes. And what that verse is saying and what it means is that no matter the different trials and tribulations that we go through, all those things are working for our good, for those who are in Christ, you know. And how they're working for our good is that it's building character. Like in my personal life, that verse helps me for my day-to-day -day life and in my life in general, since the beginning of my faith all the way up until now you know knowing that the different trials and stuff that i go through you know the good days and the bad days all those things are working for my good and i can take joy in those things because they're building my character and they're building my love towards god and towards others you know it's a purification process of me being purified and all the things about me that you know when i get irritated or when i get mad when i could just show love or pray for someone or just be in joy and in peace you know, being able to put those things aside and to be able to just sit in the presence of God and be joy, joyful and joyous because everything is working together for my good because God loves me. So I appreciate you guys listening. I would encourage you guys to, you know, call out to Jesus, call out to God for yourselves and he will answer you. You know, it says that those who draw near to God, God will draw near to them. So I encourage you guys to read, to pray, to really seek God wholeheartedly with your heart. And he will be there for you. He will answer you because he loves you. And he proved that by sending his son to die for you. Thank you guys for listening and I appreciate you guys.